mountain biking is pretty much my passion. Yeah, whenever I've got a moment to myself, I'm on the bike. And then you just get this massive air in your face. This is incredible. Uh, you know, for me, I love climbing. You know, it's a chance for me to be at one with nature. I have been kayaking since forever. I can't remember when I started to do it. It's too long ago. So I feel like um, slacklining is not something that you can just get good at over time or practice. It's something that you just born with. The style of mountain biking is pretty much, uh, it's, I'd say it's an individual thing. I like meditation about base jumping. Every time before a jump, I try to get connected to the earth and Air. You know, but yeah, it's all about being out there, just getting on with it. So I competed in the, uh, the World Slacklining Championships in Yugoslavia in 93 and uh, got seventh place there. I finished the 16th in the National Cup in Cameroon. So uh, I came all the way to Switzerland to ride here. This is where it's at. Base jumping stands for um, the four objects we jump, which are actually building, antenna, span, and earth. Well, you know, after a hard day's canyoning, we like to unwind by climbing some rocks pretty much every day, what do you reckon? Uh, let's say, sometimes we go actually before work, you know? Yeah, you gotta, you gotta take the hits, eh? you gotta take a few falls. I've taken a couple of falls in my life, and um, yeah, it's important, it just it helps you grow. It's all about doing what you feel is right, okay? This is how I got to where I am today. I'm a pretty quiet person, but if there's a crowd at the bottom watching me climb, I, you know, it makes me happy being out there with the people, with the nature, shake my guns a bit. Good, good balance is not something you can practice, it's just something that you have. And I'm uh, ridiculously good at it. Good. After that we started uh, trying to develop acro slacklining. New kind of uh, slacklining where we really push the limits. A lot of it involves um, eating cereal while you're on the line. What I do on my bike is what I call kind of a freestyle Tim action. Uh, this is where I want to ride, this is where I want to be, and I don't need to ride with anyone to have fun. It's me, my bike, my helmet, and my shoes. I don't know what these other guys are on about with these full suspension thingers. It's about being by yourself, in the woods, doing your own thing. Yeah? Full rigid, full steel, that's what I'm talking about. I was inspired by my mom. I popped off right in the kayak. Yeah, the biggest waterfall I've ever run is about one and a half meters. That was crazy. I train a lot of kayaking that uh, makes me survive in the river. Someone help me! It was a good race, a lot of good kayakers there and I'm quite happy about it but next time I start without hangover it will be better. Well, I'm, I'm 
on the edge of the cliff and in the forest, you don't have wireless, you just have a different type of connection. I started with skydiving first, but it wasn't enough for me. I knew I needed more. Actually, um, the jump point is just right here. Let's do this. Get that. Don't, don't get that. There's uh, special techniques like this to push down. Um, I love the view. I'm not a trick climber, I'm more doing the feeling stuff, which needs a bit more thinking than actually working. 